So this is a little roundup of uh, LED torches and the common factor with these five torches is that they all take a single AA battery, a single AA cell. Um, we've got three here from LED Lensa and the two smallest ones are Phoenix. So let's put the camera on its perch and have a look at them. Um, first of all we have this one, this is the LED Lensa L5 it's the only one that's made of plastic, it's polycarbonate um, being LED Lensa it has the uh, adjustable focus uh, head it's, uh, it's, but it, because it's made of plastic it's, it's, it's a bit scratchy a bit, uh, it's not the most smoothest mechanism um, we have a turn cap which switches the thing on but you can also press the button for momentary action um, I'll just uh, remove the AA cell so we've got a single battery here it's uh, rather a huge torch uh, the L5 is what is it it's, uh, well, it says it's 76 lumens all these torches are approximately the same brightness um, some are a little brighter than others I'll, uh, I'll go through them one by one so that's the L5 uh, reasonably cheap plastic torch okay let's go to the other end of the scale now and look at the Phoenix LD15 now this is by far the smallest torch and if I remove the head you can see that the battery is uh, only just a little bit smaller than the bottom half of the case so um, now this is the only torch that doesn't have a rear tail click switch so uh, one of the things you can do with it is stand it up on a table and use it in what they call candle mode to switch this one on you have to rotate the head so let's do that so there's the beam now Phoenix don't have the adjustable focus head it's um, a patented LED lens a thing. I imagine Phoenix don't want to uh, tread on LED lenses patent toes. Um, it does have two brightnesses this one but you have to switch it off and back on again and there's the dim beam and then off and on again and there's the bright beam. So the bright beam is uh, 117 lumens and the dim one, just stabilize the camera, is just 8 lumens it sounds very little and it is quite dim but one of the advantages of 8 lumens is of course that it will run, I think it's 39 hours that it will run in the low brightness mode now I find the switching on and off mechanism a bit awkward um, it's very good at switching between the two brightness levels, that seems quite reliable but it's stiff because of course you've got the o-ring in there I'd rather frankly have a, a clicky tail switch um, this one, incredibly small size, so I think if uh, small size is what you're after, maybe the Phoenix LD15 is the torch for you. Okay, let's look at the uh, LED Lenser P5. This one has a sliding head to go between a small beam and a large beam. Um, it's quite stiff, this one, and after it's not been used for a while, or if it's cold, it can be quite difficult to get that to move. Um, but it, once it's freed up it moves reasonably well there are no different brightness levels on this one, it's a fixed brightness um, now there are various different reports one website says this is 105 lumens the brochure that uh, comes with this says well in one brochure it's 59 and in the other it's 65 so even amongst LED lenses information it's not consistent um, but they're all roughly the same as I say these torches um, there's not a lot in it the Phoenix LD15 is the brightest actually at 117 lumens so that's the P5 again single AA cell okay let's have a look at the Phoenix E11 now this is actually one of my favorites it's a lower cost torch it is metal it's reasonably uh, compact size it's got a clicky switch on the back uh, it's 105 lumens and you've got this neat little thing where you just loosen off the head to switch between 105 lumens and 32 lumens which is the low brightness setting and it works really well it's really neat if you unscrew this head completely that's how you 
remove the battery and replace it. Very nice torch, this is lower priced, this one's about £15 I think, whereas the expensive one's typically 30 Um I really like this one, it's probably not my favourite, but um, definitely my second favourite. And then we come to the LED Lenser M5. Uh, this one has the most features. Very nice sliding head there for the beam to flood adjustment. It also has a click switch which if you do it quickly you get the low brightness, do it quickly again and you get the strobe which is about um, <clears throat> 8 hertz, something like that and it's designed for sort of warding off uh, potential assailants, that sort of thing. Um, the brightness levels on the M5, it's 108 lumens in full bright mode. I couldn't get a, a figure for the brightness in the uh, second brightness mode but um, it's going to be half that or something like that. That's the M5. Now I would probably pick this as my favourite torch mainly because it has uh, the greater range of features but uh, the Phoenix E11 is a very close second there's uh, there's not much uh, in it in terms of which one I pick up to use typically and so that's the LED Lenser M5